Promote your brand here at Viral Hip Hop News. Email me, Sam Ant at thehiphopnews.com. No wait, let's go. Seen, I think he was on TMZ. I don't know if it's yesterday. And you were talking about this artificial rapper <clears throat> who yeah. has since been dropped from Capitol Records. Um, I think you said in that little small interview that you thinking that there is something that they're starting to roll out to replace regular rappers. Is that correct? <laughs> How do you feel about that? I mean, they could, man, knowing them, you, they, they, they're trying to invent this technology to take jobs everywhere else. You know what I'm saying? But I don't, but, but, but also, like I said, is I, I don't, I don't really think how well that'll go over with music. You know what I'm saying? Because like you listen to a person, you, you, you listen to artists and you jar from their emotion and you jar from their real life stories that they've been through. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So it's like, you know, like you can't, you can't uh, duplicate or make that feeling virtual at all. Like right. The idea was dope. I, I thought the idea was cool, but when I saw how they were kind of rolling out this hip hop artist, you know what I mean? There was a lot of stereotypes involved with it. And then they 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 came out and said that the reason why they dropped him is because he was saying the N word and doing various things. They weren't cool with that. But I mean, this is why they, he got the deals because he was doing all this shit stereotyping black folks. So. Exactly. Talk about that in a deeper meaning, like the deeper message behind how they portray us as a culture, in particular in hip hop, and what they think is hip hop and, and what they distributed. That should be what Capitol Records did, what they just did by dropping that virtual artist because of that, just shows you they know exactly what they're doing mm -hmm. mm. by, by portraying hip hop in one in one light you know what i'm saying they know exactly what they're doing you know what i'm saying that's why they dropped it you know what i'm saying because they but 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 i mean it it it, it should have been looked at you know like look look at look at the artists they're signing and what they're promoting like you know what i'm saying like there's some good artists out here but a lot of these artists like we don't hear about these artists until they got a murder case or they're dead themselves right that's how they introduce these new artists now. You, you know what I'm saying? So that that stereotype is like how they're pushing these new artists is not cool because they're making everybody seem like, oh, it's real dangerous to be a rapper now. You might get killed. You know what I'm saying? And it's supposed to be about music. So they're trying to muddy our genre because it's the biggest one out here. We came in, we pushed country music, rock. We pushed all that out the way. And they wasn't happy about that, really. Right. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, let's muddy it up and make it look like a bunch of buffoonery, a bunch of clown shit going on. You know what I'm saying? And, and take some of the credit for it. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like hip hop is just now about to be 50 years old and we conquered the music world at 30 something. Right. For sure. You know what I'm saying? So like that's what we, it, 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 and like you said, it is much deeper than everybody looking at it. You know what I'm saying? And that's why they were so quick to jump up. And, okay. Okay. But they should have been doing that. They should have been looking at, you know what I'm saying, the stereotypes they they set by signing these certain rappers and then giving them the stuff that they need, like the pointing them in the direction of the drugs and the pills and all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. This picture is being painted on purpose. Real talk. Now, and you say that and you look at like the acts, the men and the women, you know, the men, it's just the gangster. You know, the rap, the shooting, the ops, you know, the women, it's the shaking the ass and all this. And do you think this is, I mean, I know the answer, but for the audience, you know, you think this is being engineered this way in order to continue to keep the people in a certain, you know, space? Are these bro, being promoted and pushed? Bro, it's definitely being engineered this way. Like, how come there is no, how come every single female coming out? has to look the exact, just like the dudes coming out. Every, it's yeah. like carbon copies. Yeah. They look alike, dress alike, sound alike, talk about the same thing over and over and over again. Like it's it's crazy. I was really feeling T-Pain when he put that video out and said, do something different, damn it. Mm -hmm. Like how many times we gonna see this? Like it's real though, you know what I'm saying? And then, and then they'll make it, they'll paint the picture to make it look like, oh, all the old heads is hating. No, we ain't. We love hip hop. If y'all got the floor, do something with it. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Make it entertainable. Like, okay, we understand it's money in hip hop. We had the money. We we, we understand it. We know it's money in it. We got some of that money too. Right. You know what I'm saying? We know it's there. Get over that. Okay, good. 
what's next mm -hmm. what else you going to enlighten us about like you know what i'm saying like and like that's what hip-hop needed to go because it's like they're they're trying to dumb it down on purpose and then they you, you know um it's like uh they draw this gap between the older and the younger generation and they say oh yeah they just the older artists just mad because they washed up the only reason they don't want to deal with us no more is because we've got smarter mm -hmm. we've gotten smarter and we know what we deserve and we see the games they playing and we ain't having it no more so oh yeah they washed up let's just get the new artists just fresh off the street they don't give a damn give them a couple of dollars they're gonna do what we say and by the time they figure out we the whole game it's too late. They owe us millions of dollars. And if they don't do what we say, then they can go, then they can go to hell. And that's how they get that's the cycle, man. The cycle is continuing to go in the cycle because nobody is realizing it. They the money is blinding everybody. Facts. I wanna I wanna get your thoughts on we've seen a couple months ago when